Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Hope you are doing well. If you are unable to install your Windows operating system in your laptop or desktop and you are getting this kind of error, Windows cannot be installed on drive 0, partition 1 or maybe partition 2 or partition 3. In this video, we are going to fix this issue. So first, cut this window, then click on yes. Now you will see Windows startup screen. Click on this option, repair your computer. Now click on troubleshoot. Then click on this option, command prompt. So this is the command prompt. Now you have to type a few commands to repair your hard drive and fix this issue. So the first command will be disk part, press enter. Now type the next command list space disk press enter and here you can see i have currently two disk in my laptop disk 0 is my internal hard drive of 120 gb and disk 1 is my usb pen drive which i connected with my laptop so you have to select your internal hard drive so this is my internal hard drive disk 0 so the next command will be select space disk space now you have to type the disk number of your internal hard drive so disk 0 is my internal my inbuilt hard drive of 120 gb and disk 1 is my usb pen drive so carefully select your internal hard drive so i will type 0 because 0 is my disk number of my internal hard drive then press enter now type the next command the final command will be clean and one important thing this command will totally delete totally format your internal hard drive so if you have any important data in your hard drive take the data backup first okay type this command clean then press enter and this command will clean your hard drive and remove all the errors from your hard drive now type exit press enter type exit again press enter now click on this option turn off your pc and after that start the installation process again now i will try to install my windows again click on next then click on install now then select your uh, windows 10 edition click on next then click on i accept next click on custom so now you can see this is my hard drive of 120 gb now i will create a partition so select the unallocated space then click on new then click on apply then click on ok so this is my partition you can create multiple partitions it uh, up to you okay then click on next and you can see the error has been removed so this is all for the video Thank you.